Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome back to the MurfreesBear.com show. We appreciate you tuning in. As always, uh, I'm John I. Carey, your host, and we have a great team of people here today. One off camera that you can't see, Miss Ashley over there. And then we have Kyle and Sandra, who are from the Tennessee State Veterans Home, correct, right here in Murfreesboro. Sorry. And then, Kyle, what was your title again? I'm the administrator. Administrator? Okay, Sorry. and then Miss Sandra? I'm director of clinical services for all the state veterans homes. For all of them? Yes. All right, cool. Well, I appreciate y'all coming on. I know it kind of... Uh, Getting everybody scheduled together was, you know, a little hard to do. So really appreciate you taking your time because there's really one thing I wanted to focus on with this, if you don't mind, was there's so many misconceptions people have about the Tennessee State Veterans Home or they think you are the VA or something like that. And I thought it'd be cool to have you in here and kind of clear that up because we get a lot of messages about it from people. So and, you oh, know, wow. we, we post different things. People are like, hey, aren't they the VA? No. And so, <laughs> you know, but um, if that's all right, I thought maybe we'd just talk about that a little bit. But sure. uh, um, before we get into the nuts and bolts of everything, you know, thought maybe get to know you. So, Miss Sandra, what brought you into this field? What, how long you been doing this? Uh, what brought you into it? I've never been anything except a nurse. So, oh, wow. Well, I thank came, you. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. I came um, to the state veterans homes almost fifteen years ago. Okay. I was what were a you, like six, seven. Jeez, yeah, I was. was. I can't Man. believe my mother let me have children that young. <laughs> too. But um, yeah, I came like fifteen years ago okay. as the director of clinical services, mm -hmm. and absolutely fell in love with what we do yeah. um, and who we serve. Yeah. Awesome. And just never look back. Nope. Oh, that's fantastic. Well, thank you for your service with the, with everything you do. Oh, thank you. Everybody out. So Mr. Kyle, how about you? Uh, I've not been a nurse all my life. <laughs> <laughs> out, get out, <laughs> get off the show. No. Uh, I, I actually started out as a nursing assistant and oh, okay. became an administrator yeah, uh, yeah. originally from Ohio, been yeah. in uh, Tennessee for about 17 years now. Okay. Uh, been at the, uh, at the vet's home for almost a year now okay love it nice nice so okay million dollar question you said you're from ohio yes buckeyes or vols buckeyes. you better get oh this right. man okay all right <laughs> we'll let it slide just no I'm just <laughs> hey they're a good team you can't argue that yes, so sir. awesome well cool okay so we got that but um all right so over at the how do you abbreviate it tsvh correct? yes oh that's okay i've heard that several times so at the tennessee state veterans home so um I'm just going to jump right to it, if you don't mind, because sure. because we get a lot of messages about this and people asking if you're the VA or, you know, different service, things like that. So what exactly go into it, what you do, the services, all that sort of stuff, how you're different. So the VA is um, federal government. Okay. We are a political um, subdivision of the state of Tennessee, which okay. means we're quasi state. Mm -hmm. Um we uh, operate as a nonprofit, obviously, since mm -hmm. we're part of the state government. Um, in order to get into one of our homes, of course, you know, someone has to have been honorably discharged mm -hmm. from the military. Um, we're not allowed to take, like, um, National Guard unless they were activated. And okay. we have lots of National Guard at this point that now have active service. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so... Uh, someone would need their DD-214. We offer physical, occupational, speech therapy. We have the most amazing activity staff mm -hmm. ever. Yeah. Um, you may find our men and women out fishing on a creek bank somewhere or just going out That's to cool. eat at Hooters to watch mm -hmm. the pretty girls go by <laughs> or, you know, Shout at Buster's, yeah. you know. Yeah. We just, we do lots of trips. We do lots of things mm -hmm. um, that we're able to do because of that whole nonprofit. Yeah, yeah. You know, the any um, profits are going right back into the home, right yeah. back into employees and okay. into residents. So. Oh, very cool. Okay, I mm -hmm. didn't know that. All right. Well, mm -hmm. it's a good way to, I mean, take care of your residents. No, Absolutely. A, yeah. The, I've, I met several in there when I went in there. We did a little tour forever ago. And um, the stories some of them were telling. Oh, my like, gosh. Oh, my God. I was like, I could, seriously, I could go back in there and just sit there all day and just yeah. pick their brains. That's just for listening over half. Yeah. Right? Yeah. That's why we love what we do. Yeah. Right? So I was like, man, and the, the poor lady giving me a tour, she's like, John, we, we have to go. I was like, <laughs> but I want to talk. Mm -hmm. So, okay, cool. So We have met some of the coolest people yeah. that have ever put a pair of shoes on. Yeah. What's a, I, I got to ask, what's a cool story you remember? somebody or can you talk about well, it well yes okay um, right. because these stories that we would talk about have been published so it wouldn't be a privacy oh, okay. issue okay. as a nurse one of the coolest stories i've ever heard is there was a nurse that um got caught behind enemy lines at the battle of the bulge Whoa. so she's at a mash hospital the germans are advancing 
and she hears there's wounded, so she and several other nurses go out to take care of, as she called, the boys. Yeah. And so when they went out, um, the Germans advanced. She got caught behind enemy lines. I said, oh, my God, were you not so scared? She said, no, honey. <laughs> we knew the boys would come. Yeah. We hunkered down through the night. We took care of our wounded, and the boys came, and everything was fine. No Here way. I am. Wow, that's cool. I got that just gave me you chills. You know, we yeah. all think that, you know, we're bad for, you know, doing something. No, they are the original yeah. bad ones. Right. It, it's like that movie. What's the movie? Uh is it Hacksaw or something? I can't remember the Hacksaw Ridge. Yeah. Hacksaw Ridge, yeah, yeah, yeah where yeah. he no guns, no nothing. He was he was he was mm-hmm. the man that just went he's like, I they got me. I know it. That's so cool. Okay. We've met a spy Oof. that was deeply embedded with Hitler. Whoa. Yeah. Okay. Hold yeah. on. Can you tell that one? I gotta hear that. Yeah. Um, lady came, um, family didn't have the DD-214, and we're like, yeah, she had one. Mm-hmm. Well, no. He said, oh, hold on. Mom told me if she ever needed care, and he kind of trailed off and left, comes back, and he has a scrap of paper. Mm-hmm. It's a phone number and a name. Our admissions person calls the phone number. It's the Pentagon, and it's her what? handler. She's in her late 80s, <clears throat> excuse me, several years ago. No way. Her children had no idea that she was deeply embedded with Hitler. No way. Their dad was already gone. He was, too. They were instrumental in several of our victories in World War II, and their children never knew. <gasps> what? So a lot of that was declassified, and then they got to look at those yeah. um, documents to see what their parents had really done. That's incredible. Mm-hmm. Ms. Ashley, is that, can we, like, come in and film and, like, I record mean, some of these stories? Let's do it. That's incredible. I would love to do that. We could do a whole series on you. Wow. That's a hell of a story. Mm-hmm. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, we'll, we'll leave it on that And one. those are yeah. only two <laughs> That's just two. So many. Yeah. Yeah. Dang. That's that's really neat. Okay. Mm-hmm. Awesome. All right. Well, we'll continue those later. So. Yes. <laughs> but awesome. So, so Mr. Kyle, yours is, you said you're the administrator. Yes, sir. Okay. So, you just... Do you run the whole place, or how does that work? Or well, they tell me that I do. You know? Actually, I, I work with a great team <laughs> yeah, of yeah. folks. I've got a I've got a wonderful partner, uh, Lisa Southern, who is mm-hmm. my director of nursing. Uh, team of folks that's been here. Some of them have been here for a long time. Some of them are brand new to our team. Yeah, but, yeah. Uh, the one thing we all have in common is we all. We like our guys. We yeah. love our guys, and uh, we. It's exciting when we get there. We get to hear these stories every day. Yeah, and, right. Uh, and the more they they learn about us, and that we're in part of their lives, they share more and more. Yeah. And just when you think you know it can't get any more amazing, there's yeah. something else that comes. So up, I'd say know? it probably yeah. never gets old, does it? No. That's incredible. Like, see, I could hear stuff like that all day. That's incredible. He's the best history lesson ever. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. That's awesome. So, so how many how many residents do you have there? We have a hundred and three as oh, of wow. this morning. Oh, as of this morning. Okay, yes. gotcha. Do you have um, a maximum capacity over there or anything? We we can take up to a hundred and forty. Okay, gotcha. Uh, so we're we're down a little bit, but um, but yeah, that's our capacity. Okay, nice. Okay, and then so as far as the criteria, can you go over that again in order sure. to get in there? Okay. So there has to be um, a Tennessee connection. Okay. So let's use Kyle as okay. an example. He lives here, but his dad's still in Ohio. Okay. His dad could come to Tennessee State Veterans Home because okay. he has a Tennessee connection. Okay, got it. Or if someone lives in Hawaii, but they inducted into the um, armed forces in Tennessee, mm-hmm. they're automatically eligible. Okay, okay. So, cool. again, it just has to be active service and um, uh, honorable discharge. Okay, honorable discharge. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, and just going that route, so if they're dishonorably discharged, they can't. No. Okay, gotcha. No, and that's not that's not a rule that we make. It was you know made through legislature oh, yeah, yeah, when no, the state veterans homes were set up. But one of the greatest things, and you know, why would you pick us? If a veteran um, is at least seventy percent or more service connected, mm-hmm. they stay with us for free. Wow. Okay. Um, the VA completely pays. Mm-hmm. You know they. Give us a per diem. They pay for it. It meds everything. Holy moly. Okay. So it doesn't matter, as we were talking earlier um, about the family farm, it doesn't matter what their assets yeah. are apart. This is That's a benefit right. you know, that they earned when yeah. they were serving, and especially when they you know, were injured or whatever um, yeah. caused their disability. Okay. Um, so at a 70 to 100 yeah. percent, they pay nothing. Now, if they're less than 70%, mm-hmm. yes, they can still come. Yeah. But VA gives them a per diem to help pay for their stay. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. 
And then is it, is it just happenstance that y'all happen to be built right next to the, the VA that y'all are right next? Do you work with them in any capacity or how's that? Work? Um, we're always um, partnering with them oh, okay, with cool. different initiatives or, um, you know, we're actually inspected by VA yearly. Okay. Gotcha. So there's federal inspectors that come in and we're also inspected by um, Tennessee, what used to be Tennessee Department of Health. They've got yeah. a new, they've kind of rearranged, but we okay. have inspectors from um, state of Tennessee that come yeah. in as well. Okay. Nice. Okay, cool. Yeah, I've been over there a few times. Actually, that's one thing you beat me to it because I remember you said inspect. I was thinking it it was very clean when I was mm-hmm. over there. Like, I was like, is there any dirt anywhere? <laughs> there better not be. <laughs> yeah, there better not be. Yeah, right? I was like, the the white glove test or whatever it is. Yeah. No, that would, yeah, I just remember that being one of the things. I'm like, wow, it was very clean. Like, mm-hmm. the hallways we were walking down, like, okay, all right. <laughs> the, the, the standards that that we have supersede any place i've ever worked yeah and i've worked for several mm-hmm. big companies but the the standards here are much higher just because of the population we serve it's yeah. expected we okay. owe it to these guys and yeah ladies. oh yeah heck yeah that's right i thousand percent agree with you on that that's fantastic okay you asked me about admission yes, um, one thing i did leave out we also and i think this is extremely cool we're able to take gold star parents wow okay so um, that's part of the legislation. So if okay. someone okay. has um, a child that was serving and was killed, mm-hmm. they're automatically eligible to come to the wow. veteran's home. Okay. All right. Cool. Well, that's fantastic. Mm-hmm. All right. Now, do you have, I'm curious, do you have like groups that come by and visit them or anything like that? Or oh, is, my gosh. Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, the Hooters girls, we have the Hooters is awesome, greatest, apparently. Yeah. Dang, this is we great. have <laughs> the greatest support um, from Rutherford County. Uh, Hooters may just come in and mm-hmm. um, have lunch with the guys. Mission Barbecue may stop by and oh, yeah. bring lunch. Um, and I don't want to leave anybody out. I hate that I've even named anybody. Oh, but a, there's always um, uh, lots and lots, especially at Christmas time. Really? Yeah. People bring gifts and things like that? There's an 18-wheeler that backs up usually at the door. No way. Um, it's, it's incredible. Yeah, it's an 18-wheeler? An Nissan has done that for years. Shout out Nissan. Heck yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. And they just load we it up just, with gifts and bring yes, it Yes. Wow. And I'm, I cannot begin to say how much um, support this community has always given us. Yeah. And it's awesome. Wow, I'd like to see, keep me updated on that. I'd like to see that come out. I'd like to get that on camera, <laughs> actually, to be honest. That would be amazing. The, yeah. the generosity of this community. I mean, it's, and it's not just uh, at different times. It's, yeah. it's sometimes multiple times a day. Yeah, really? Uh, yeah, and uh, I'll, I'll get a call. And I, I can remember I just got a call one morning and said, uh, we'd like to donate a pool table. What? And <laughs> uh, family members came in there, and, and it, you know, I was thinking, it's been in somebody's garage. And, yeah, uh, yeah, no, got, they, yeah. You know, they, uh, no, this is a brand new no way. pool table. Paid to have it installed, delivered. Um, what a cool thing. It's it, it's amazing, uh, some of the things. <laughs> or um, we we had a, a group that just came down and said, uh, we took a collection, wanted to bring guys a check. We don't care what you spend it on. Really? And, uh, wow. I mean, it's it's just incredible the generosity yeah. that's, that's in this community and the connectedness yeah. we have. Damn, I'll throw it out there. Next call, hot tub. Coming in and stuff. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I can install that right over there in the back. No, that's really cool. I didn't, so can, uh, as far as visitation, is there, like, do you have to schedule that, or can people just come in? and? It, it's better. I mean, go ahead. Yeah, sure. but was, it, it depends on what it is. If it's a group, obviously, we want to uh, be able to make sure that we don't have anything conflicting with that. We yeah. want to have uh, any activities. That mm-hmm. We like diverse activities, too. Yeah. Um, but, uh, you know, if it's groups, they just want to come in and tour. Yeah. Uh, if you want time, they want to ask questions, obviously make an appointment. Yeah, if yeah. it's just got the curiosity, come in here. We'll always make time for Oh, that's it. fantastic. All right, you hear that, folks? Watching, listening out there? You can go by any time, and they will accommodate you. So get some visitors over there. Cool. Uh, well, speaking of more people over there, I hear you all hiring. We are. You we are? are. What are you hiring? What positions? Uh, right now, I have, I'm hiring uh, nurses, okay, CNAs, mm-hmm. and housekeepers, okay, primarily. Uh, we have hired quite a few just over the last couple months. Okay, um, we're fighting that same uh, yeah. demon everybody else has, you know, with COVID and the, yeah. the rearranging of, of uh, staff. But 
we're also blessed that we have enough folks to take care of our folks. Too. Yeah. So it's okay. uh, it's it's a really good place. We have a ton of resources that we can draw from. Okay, gotcha. Do you have like you need like five nurses and five LPNs, or is it yes. just like bring as many as you can? Yeah. I'll take. I'll take. We're, we're I'm looking for good people. I'm not hiring. Yes. I'm not yes. hiring bodies. I'm okay. Where we are hiring uh, folks that obviously have the qualifications, yeah. but also have that servant's heart that, yeah. that uh, they're there to take care of our, yeah. we call them our, our, our folks, you know, yeah. that's, that's theirs. fantastic. Okay, cool. So do you have a pretty strict vetting program? I imagine. We so, do. Okay. Awesome. Is, is that across the board on all of them? You yes, looking it is. For? Okay. It is. You know, one of the coolest things about working with us, you know, we like to talk about and tell people, Oh, we have state retirement. Mm -hmm. Nobody who, who in the free world is offering a fully funded retirement anymore yeah i got you so in five years you're fully vested mm -hmm. and i know that doesn't mean a lot to you if you're 25 years old trust me listen to old me yes will so yes and, listen folks but <laughs> that's not even the coolest um the coolest reason to work for us is the people that we serve oh yeah the men and women who signed the check so you didn't have to yeah. they stood in the stead they're the reason we don't speak German is our national language. The reason we don't speak other languages. They're the reason that we are sitting at this table. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. And yeah. we don't have to worry about what we're saying. And oh my gosh, it's going out and people are going to hear it. Yeah. No, they are the reason that we can do all the things that we do. Yeah. And if you, as Kyle said, have a servant's heart, mm -hmm. they deserve you. Yeah. Oh no, I this is, yeah I agree with you ten thousand percent on all that stuff. So we kind of have a rule like the the ladies up front they're big huge veteran supporters. One of them is military family and everything. So you know anytime like if we see them out eating, we try to buy their meals. You know I I've literally like pushed in front of you know people to pay for their stuff and they're like what are you doing? I'm like no thank you. You know so but uh, no like we got to take care of those who take care of us. You know so full, fully believe that. But awesome cool. Well on on the job front sorry. I, Digress a little bit. <laughs> um, so, again, if, I just want to hit it again so people can hear it. So, you want nurses? It was LPN. The list them all again. Nurses. Yeah, nurses. Yeah, okay. Yeah. We, we, yeah. Do, we hire LPNs. We also hire RNs. Okay. Um, and uh, we're looking for techs, and we're looking for housekeepers right now. Okay. Um, we uh, are always looking out for good people. Okay. So. Like full time, part time, I have both. All of the above. Yes, sir. Okay, <laughs> gotcha. Is is overtime offered or anything like that? Uh, yes. Okay, yeah. gotcha. Just like to throw it all out there. Yeah. Yeah. You said time the, and yeah. the benefits and retirement and all that stuff. Benefits are about. awesome. Yeah. We have you know state insurance. We um we have a really generous PTO. Okay. And it depends on you know, how long you've been yeah. there is how much you're accruing, but okay. the bottom tier is um a week. Yeah. So. Oh wow. A yeah. week and you get PTO. Okay. No, not in a week. Oh, I was a week like, wow, that was fast. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Yeah. Sign yeah. me up. You know. <laughs> My boss right now yeah. just fell out of his yeah. chair. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, folks. My bad. <laughs> get up, bud. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll edit that. No, I'm just kidding. But no. Okay, cool. Sorry, sorry for the mis <laughs> mis uh, fusion on my part there. Okay, and so are looking immediately right now. Yes, you sir. can take We're, people. You you can you can find our ads right now. They're posted on Indeed. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, direct link to our application process. Yep. Uh, we also are going to have um, you're going to see us different places. You're going to see us mm -hmm. before the movies. Before yeah. long, we'll have a commercial there. Oh, there you go. Okay. Where uh, Miss Ashley's got us, where you can just scan a little code and yeah. it'll take you right to our our job postings, our application okay. process. Very cool. Gotcha. Yeah, we'll post those flyers and stuff you send too. So I'll we, we try to make it easy as we can. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> I know we've posted a few times with the flyers, and I, I noticed like people will tag other. Hey, you need to check this out. You need to check this out. So it's cool to see the community pushing you guys as well. That's really neat. So. Awesome. But, uh, you know, I know we talked about, I want to hear more stories, but I know uh, we can just go <laughs> on and on and on. So, but, uh, um, just one more. Can you just hear one I'll more? I'll give you one just more. Just one more? Okay. I just want to hear one more. And this is, this is a Murfreesboro story, actually. <gasps> so, right. um, and this is actually on the internet. You can see it. So it's okay. not a privacy thing either. We had an elderly gentleman that was a World War II veteran uh -huh. and he was starting to decline getting closer to end of life, and one of the activity people said, is there anything you haven't done that you still want to do? Uh -huh. And he was a fighter pilot in okay. World War II. And he said, I'd love to fly again. I wouldn't have to, like, drop bombs, but I would like to fly. Yeah. I feel like Murfreesboro would really appreciate the no bomb thing. You're so right. <laughs> Smyrna Air National Guard was called... MTSU Aerospace Program was called. 
The next thing you know, he not only has a flight suit, what? but Smyrna Air National Guard gets his DD-214. This man had like 27 air medals from D-Day. What? He flew 30-some-odd missions. Now, think about on oh D-Day. Oh, gosh. Your life expectancy was your next mission. Really? So, yeah, oh, yeah, wow. Yeah, okay. because, I mean, you that was huge. So... He would come in, look at you, John. You got kids? Yeah, I got kids. I'll take his flight. He did that all day no way. and all night. Oh, okay. and no, and lived to tell about it. So, yeah. so we bring him over to the airport. Um, he can't, you know, walk. So it's a dignity thing. We actually load him into the plane in the hangar. Okay, and they taxi out of the hangar. Okay, okay. He flew over Murfreesboro. This is the hardest story to tell. Ugh. Flew over Murfreesboro, and he is smiling. He's yeah. not verbal at this point. Oh, wow. So he's, he's just smiling, and he's looking everywhere. And as we land, there's a big C-130 that comes over and does the, yeah, yeah. the D- wing wiggle. Yeah, they tilt the wings. Sorry, yeah. peeps, I don't know what it's called. <laughs> so they wiggle the their wings, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, um, and there's a tear running down his face. And he passed a week later. Oh. <gasps> But he got to fly again. That hey. is who we are. You got, me, whoa, you got me all choked up now. Yeah. Holy cow. Okay. I'm going to take a break from the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, that gave me goosebumps again. Oh, my gosh. That's incredible. And you got, wow. Okay. Well, that – I, <laughs> I was going to ask a question, but that totally blew all the other answers you could have given <laughs> away. So I was going to say, do you ever do anything for any of them that they just light up and you're like, oh, my God, we got to go bowling or something. But that oh, is incredible yeah. what you just said. Yeah. <laughs> so. yeah, bowling is one of their calm nights. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So do I? Do we need to show up in a party bus? Is that what we need to do? Absolutely. <laughs> you know, well, there have been charter buses pull up to that. You building know what? Before. Honestly, we could. I don't know. I know a certain somebody out there who could probably make that happen if he's watching. If oh. you're watching, we'd love to. Have he owns you. a company that runs those, and uh, he might. Okay. We have had <laughs> charter buses, um, of course. You know that we rented. Um, yeah. That went to Atlanta to see how Coke's bottled. No uh, way. Went to the aquarium in Chattanooga. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, there's been lots of things like that. Oh but, my you know, gosh. just just to roll out and get on the big bus. Yeah. I mean, you know, and then go to the aquarium just like a regular man or woman would. Yeah. <clears throat> so. Yeah. We're not a warehouse. Yeah. yeah. If, oh, no. If, yeah. If exactly. If, 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 you're, if you're coming... If if you are a veteran and you're looking to mm-hmm. for a place where you're just not working, if things aren't working at home, you need some support. Yeah. If you're coming for a place just to come and lay in bed, yeah, we're not that. I got yeah. I got we, you. We we are a place that we're going to give you help to live out yeah. the rest of your days and the camaraderie that is among our residents. Yeah. You know we we were laughing yesterday. We have a a grandchild that comes and visits granddad every day. And cool. she's sitting around, and I'm looking around, and there's a ranger. There's another ranger, Green Beret. I said, she's got the best security team in the world. Right? right yeah. Now. yeah. <laughs> oh, they're all her uncles, but it's, you see all these tough guys. Yeah. Cooing over a little bit. Oh, of you course. Know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You want to watch these guys melt? Watch this. Go ahead. Go, ahead. go in there. <laughs> so, and, it, you know, and our guys, we go out, and we do a, yeah. a lot of things. I keep saying guys, but it's yeah. – uh, you know, we have ladies also. Oh, yeah, but, yeah. yeah. No, I, we get you. But, yeah. Um, All but, inclusive. But, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, we – but we, we do fun things because we, we think that, you know, it's obviously a, a thank you for everything that they've done. But yeah. we also have a, a spotlight uh, – on our residents, when we will actually, our, our department has to sit around and during our morning meeting and say, yeah. let's pick somebody, anybody got anything that the, any of the residents that they just want to do, something yeah. cool they want to do, yeah. and we'll we'll make that happen. Okay. Uh, sometimes it's as small as, I want a Cajun boil. Yeah. Or, oh, wow. Okay. Or, you know, That'd be fun. <laughs> or I want to go to the shooting range. I'd like to put something down range a little bit, which yeah. we've got that planned coming up. Do you? So okay. Yeah, All right. Mm-hmm. Very cool. Oh, that'd be fun. So, Will you let me know? I want to come see this stuff. This is so cool. Of, um, you know, lots of folks see nursing homes as the last stop. Okay. No, they're yeah. not. We are the next chapter. Yeah. Ah. Okay. We are the fun chapter, and you get to celebrate all the things you've had to do in your life. Yeah. I got <laughs> so you. So yeah. now this is just to come have fun, yeah. mm-hmm. um, hang out with us, let us take care of yeah. you. Very cool. And we're just going to have a blast. Yeah. It, it, one more thing, if you don't mind, I want to ask. So, like, if if I went in there, for example, and sat down and just happened to 
strike up a relationship with somebody there, one of the, one of the, um, one of the residents. And if I came in one day, I was like, Hey, I'd really like to take them and go do something. Is that, is that something that can happen? Or yeah. What that, we okay. would have to do is that, um, if that person, you know, of course, is their own responsible party, that's fine. You know, okay. they can give consent, okay. but we would notify their family, yeah. is this okay? Yeah. John's here. He wants to take, you know, your dad yeah. over to Captain D's yeah. or, you know, yeah. where. Yeah. Yeah. But I was thinking something so, like if they yeah. wanted to go to, like, a Preds game or something. Yeah. And be like, yeah. hey, you know, yeah, we've done that. that. Have you? We've been to Titans games. We've oh, tailgated at awesome. MTSU. Yeah. We've been to the Grand Old Opry. Oh, very cool. They held court. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. there's a lot of – I'm just thinking, you know, we, we do – a little bit of work in Nashville too. And there's a lot of companies out there that are very supportive of veterans and be like, yeah, come on in, you know, they'll just take care of you. So that's kind of where I'm thinking, but yeah, that okay. sounds great. Very cool. Man, we'll cross that bridge after when, <laughs> when the cameras are off, <laughs> but okay, cool. Well, well, thank you all for coming on. I really appreciate well, it. This is great. We uh, really appreciate you having us here. We'd love to talk about who we yeah. are and what we do. Oh and, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, if you're a nurse or a nurse aide, um, you know, we have, we're a little bit different in that we have 24 hour RN coverage. Okay. Um, most physicians come into most nursing homes one day a month. Mm -hmm. We have physicians and nurse practitioners that are there several times a week. Okay. Gotcha. So Very just cool. a little different. Okay. And your website, if people wanted more information was TV or TSVH org. Correct. Right. Yes. I get that right. Okay. Gotcha. Yes. I told you my brain wants to switch those for some reason. I don't know why, but but I'll put all that in the description of the video so people can do that. And Sounds then great. Looking for people right away. Yes, sir. If you want to come visit, come on down. All that good stuff. I'll put it yeah. all in the description so people can do that. So um, cool. Before we we finish, you all want to say anything else? Throw anything else out there for everybody? Just thanks a lot for having us. Oh no problem. Yes, thanks sir. for Thank coming. You. And you can come and visit anytime. Oh yes, I'm, I was serious on the, uh, yeah. on the, especially the uh, the interview stuff with. The, oh, that would be fantastic. That would be, the amount of stories, my gosh, it's, it, it's truly amazing. I mean, yeah, I, we we have a gentleman that you know served on secret uh, service with under President Johnson. Oh, and uh, geez, at least. has some. You want to hear some really funny stories? Really? That, that's ah. like, and uh, we have artists in house. And, yeah, uh, it's it's really. The, the, the people that we have there, I, I know, I keep saying amazing. Yeah. But it's, it's just a, it's a place where you get up every morning, you can't wait to get there. Yeah, right. And uh, the warm and fuzzies, you know, we get a paycheck, warm and fuzzies are free. That, uh, oh, well said. That's really good. I like that. <laughs> yeah. Put that on one of our t shirts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right? That's probably the best way to describe it right there. And yeah. cut right there. No, that's awesome. Cool. Okay. Uh, well, again, thank you all for your time. I know scheduling everything was kind of, you know, getting everybody on the same page. I really appreciate you oh. working with us on that. So well, thank you for it. But, uh, but yeah, we need to have you back. Talk some more. Yeah. More stories love it. All right, cool. Well, thank you all again. I appreciate it. And to everybody watching and listening, thank you for tuning in as always. And we'll see you on the next one.